From the NBC Tonight team tonight, an apparent act of road rage caught on camera. Video showing a woman with a knife at a drugstore drive through attacking a car. But she claims she's the victim. The family inside that car physically okay, but their car is scratched and slashed. Its tires popped. Well, she was arrested, but only after the cops were shown the video. Now, the family tells the I-team's Parker Gavigan the charges aren't strong enough. Parker? Well, Gina Patrice, she clearly has a weapon, a knife. And what you can see from the video, she used it to damage this family's SUV, and they say terrorize them. She was arrested, but ultimately not charged with using the weapon. Why? I grab her. I grab her. She looked like she had the devil in her eyes. It's also looked like she had a devil in her face. Carl Camillo, his wife, teenage daughter, and family dog in shock at the CVS drive through on Broad Street when a woman driving this green SUV tried to nudge her way in front of Camilo, hitting his car. <laughs> what happened in the next two minutes, absolutely terrifying for this family. She came with a knife, with a very aggressive face. She goes slowly on the back door like this. She was working with the two hands very carefully to make sure the whole car get damaged, vandalized. The woman, identified by police reports as 25-year-old Stephanie Dominguez, had two small kids in the back seat. And looked like that she was enjoying what she was doing. What she was vandalizing my car, she was enjoying. Did she, she pop all the tires? Yes. She popped every single tire, one by one, to make sure that my car will be disabled, not able to drive. The video shows the woman, knife in hand, coming back for a second round of damage and up close and personal threats. At that point, she was trying to attack us personally, and she was trying, when she came back, to open the door, you can see the video, and to get inside the car with a knife. I, at that moment, I think that she was trying to attack or kill us. Were you fearful that she was going to try to get into your car? Yes. If the, if the window will be open, we will be dead at this point. Now, police arrested Dominguez for vandalism, disorderly conduct, and a weapons charge. She pleaded not guilty on those, but the weapons charge was dropped in court. Now, a city spokesperson tells me criteria was not met for that third charge, but there could still be more charges, she says. Dominguez's lawyer, well, he says the other driver caused the accident and refused to move, move his car off of hers, and that she, Dominguez, was concerned for the, her children. Sir